Welcome back, everybody. It is 641. Let's talk farmers markets. It's a beautiful day out there, and farmers markets in Franklin, you guys know what you're doing. This is Emily <laughs> Snyder here from Franklin. Okay, so tell me what's happening in Johnson County this morning. I want to hear Yes, about of course. So we have the Franklin Farmers Market coming up. It's today starting at 8 a.m. till 12 p.m. Mm -hmm. It's just two blocks of the courthouse in Johnson County mm -hmm. um, in downtown Franklin. It's super exciting this year. For the first session, we have 45 vendors. Jeez. Um, and it's everything from produce to baked goods and cinnamon twists, which is a huge hit, <laughs> um, to we have some crafts and local artists that come too. You so can often lots find some, of yeah, some real gems. Lots that are of there. different things. Oh, that's a lot to look forward to. Now, some folks, uh, especially well. Some folks will start a farmer's market and they'll be so proud of their four or five booths, which is great. That's how they got started. But you <laughs> guys have been building for years and yes. years. How old is this farmer's market? Um, so the farmer's market we think is about 20 years old. Um, and it's definitely expanded from there from when it started, it was at the Franklin Parks and Rec Department mm -hmm. at their building. And it was just a couple, four or five vendors. Right. Um, and then in 2011, Discover Downtown Franklin took it over and we moved it over um, by the courthouse with a large parking lot so we can fill it with lots of vendors. I can imagine a lot of folks from Johnson County obviously going to want to come yes, and be there, but absolutely. I can imagine people from other counties coming too, yes. especially about this uh, cinnamon sugar twist. Yes. I've heard about <laughs> these. What on earth is in those? And so Jonna Barnett, she has a booth and it's called um, uh, Bread with a Twist. Okay. And these cinnamon twists, I'm not even joking, people will be in <laughs> line for four hours the, the whole entire time market. just for these cinnamon <laughs> twists. She like always makes like tons and tons more sure. each week. And she can never keep up. So they're amazing. They're kind of like donuts, but they're her special little okay, treat. Okay. And like everyone <laughs> wants to go. Yes. <laughs> well, that's the secret about farmers markets, right? My friends are like, oh, you go to the farmers market, you bring a bag like this, you know, and you fill up on produce. I'm like, actually, most of what I get at a farmers market, is, I eat there. Oh, right? absolutely. You got to have a mix between the two. So. I love it. Absolutely. And you don't have just food. As you mentioned, you've got some other vendors who come in, I yes. can imagine. Jewelry. Tell me what else people can yeah, see. Yes, so we have jewelry. We have local artists this year. We actually have um, a lady who does watercolor. So we're really excited to bring nice. art in back into the community. Um, and then we have a lady who does, um, she has pieces of wood that she does calligraphy on. Oh, wonderful. Um, so we have all different types of local crafts. And as long as it's homegrown or handmade, mm -hmm. um, we accept it into our farmer's oh, market. We love so. anything Indiana yeah. grown. Folks here know that. Now, um, I know you have a couple of like special days that are happening. Tell me about some of these. Yeah, days. so Discover Downtown Franklin, we are a nonprofit organization. Mm -hmm. And we put out the farmer's market, but we also do a lot of other events. And um, so our big event is coming up next week. It's okay. actually next Friday, and it's Strawberries on the Square. Mm -hmm. It's right on the courthouse steps, so you can't miss it. Um, it's kind of one of those community traditions in Franklin that starts summer. It's pretty amazing. Um, we have we sell thousands and thousands of strawberry shortcake. Um, <laughs> it's only five dollars, and then we have local music um, and mm -hmm. a movie at the art craft, so all kinds of entertainment to keep you company. You put a lot of effort into making this a full experience, and I know it shows because you do get big <laughs> crowds out there yes. today, eight o'clock, right? Yes, eight correct. to noon, and you're just west of Frank of, um, of Franklin. The Courthouse. Of the courthouse yes. in Franklin College over there. Awesome. Yes. Well, perfect. Thanks for coming in, Emily. Thank We're you. glad to share your news, of course, and, and Indiana Grown being so proud to be a part yes. of all this. Perfect. Great. Thank you awesome. so much. All right. We appreciate you. Mark